Hey, 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 hey. I'm super, super excited to bring to you my bias only webinar. I am Victory Post. It is my tradition to always ensure that I take my customers onboarding on our product platform and ensure that they have the first experience in making money right on the go using our product. Of course, I believe you're already getting a whole lot of touch getting the academy as presented by my partner, David Farrell. It is of utmost concern to me to ensure that I organize this buyers only webinar just as was promised to get to connect with my buyers and get to know how you're faring. I believe uh, while this uh, discussion last, I call it a discussion because I have the uh, opportunity to send back your feedback through the mail or through support ticket for us to get to attend to you. All right, so while this discussion lasts, we're looking at and uh, how you can. Uh, apply the tips from the academy. We're also looking at how to set up your one click drop shipping app with Shopify. Of course, we'll be looking at the ultimate uh, aspect of this, which is uh, how to make money from your drop shipping academy. We'll be looking at two perks here uh, basically, two approach with which you can use. Of course, the first approach is a crazy option you have using drop ship one click app directly to set up your own Shopify account to start making a huge uh, profit margin from selling your choice product. Of course, from the academy, you're going to see how you can select your niches, how you can select hot selling product, and of course, what and what you can do to select uh, in-demand products. All right, so finally, you'll be looking at how you can make money from uh, crazily uh, helping others to set up their yeah, as becoming an agency yourself. I've got uh, several guys that are making tons of figures out there just helping people to set up their own drop shipping platform. With this academy, I can assure you that you'll be well equipped to start setting up the same for other guys as well. So right now, I'll be taking you through the uh, members dashboard where you get to see the entire course outline, the courses which you will be going through. So that brings us to how to apply the tips from the academy. All right, so taking you down straight into the members dashboard. All right, good. So right here we are on our dropshipping selling academy dashboard. On the dashboard here, you have instruction, and now you can go about using the members area of course. If you click on the login to the one click drop shop drop ship here it takes you to the app dashboard directly but if you don't want to go there i believe you're already familiar with using the drop shipping or uh, drop ship selling academy or uh, 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 course outline here of course you get to see the entire course outline the intro uh, what drop shipping and uh, what products to sell telling you the solution uh, products which you should be going at for. Don't just go selling products because uh, you like it, but sell product that solves a problem. And don't just go selling products that are, are, are the ones to break people's bank, but be reasonable with your price markup. Also, be looking at how to drop ship from Shopify intro. You also be looking at how to establish a brand in three minutes. Also, be looking at how to find a killer niche. Also be considering how to find an audience to target, how to find killer products on AliExpress, and as well as the advanced strategies to find top products on AliExpress. Also be looking at how to get amazing brigades on AliExpress, and uh, that will take you down to how to tend to fit products on AliExpress, how to know if your product will sell like hard cakes, and through techniques number one on eBay, completed listing, you get to see technique number two on Amazon, Technique number three on therapy, or to see technique number four on watch count. You're also going to hear about the seven killer products to sell on your Shopify stores. You're also looking at money making idea, the food messages. You have to have the money making idea number two, handmade pipes. Have the money making idea number three, the microfiber towers, and the number 21 are cost outline. You have the money making idea number four, the beach towers. Number five is the car air fresheners, and number six is the car wash meat. Number seven is the dash cams, and number eight is the pillowcases. Then you have the drop shipping secret you must know. 
You are also look at how to promote tripwire authors with your Facebook ad. Also see how to optimize the picture of your Facebook ad and how to optimize the text for your ad. So all this 29 hour course outline does get you equipped to become a rock star in a drop shipping. But one thing you should note is in as much as this uh, course remains with you and you have lifetime access, it is also expected that while going through this course, have a very serious disposition. Picture yourself in a classroom setting and always have a note by your side and on this note try to outline some important actionable tips. Actionable tips tips you want to take to action the next moment or the next hour because you already have the courses as well as an access to your one click dropship app so as you're going through it look at what you've already done because I believe by now you've already been having your hands on the tool seeing how to set up the store for those of you that have not gotten store already once you are doing that just have a note by your side and look at some of the tips on the store you've set up if you had previous stores and your store is not doing well you can get to write down some tips that has been exposed here that you want to implement the next moment. Of course, as you study, implement straight up, don't wait until it's perfect. Once you get a tip, put it to action and gradually get to optimize your approach. And that's what our Dropshipping Academy is all about. Just like you'll be told in the entire section here, you are informed to always try to keep your style simple and get it up straight so as to have the highest appeal by your customers all right so that's how you go about it here and uh, of course uh, if you look at all of these courses here whichever course you want to go for once you click on it you get to see the progress which you've made with your courses so let's say we want to just set here how to know if your product will sell like hotcakes once you click on that it takes you to the cost itself and on the cost you get to see the duration and you get to see your current progress you've made for such cost so once you click on it the cost goes and it plays once play you can always go down now in this week. you can always get down to the next lesson so that's the tip I want to give to you always put a note down have a very serious disposition picture yourself in the classroom and picture that instructor on the whiteboard giving you necessary instruction but this time of course you can do it while in your sitting room or you can do it right on your rest bed but put all points to action that's just what I've got to tell you so let's now get over on the next uh, content of a slide which has to do with setting up uh, so in this section we're looking at how to set up a one clip drop shipping app with Shopify so in this case, uh, I would want to show you right from the scratch, assuming that you've not already got in a Shopify store. I'm going to show you how you can get a trial version and thereafter you can upgrade it, make some payment to get it upgraded. Alright, so let's go back to our dashboard here. Alright, so on your account, like I showed you before, you're going to see this link that says log in to your one click dropship here. And uh, once you click on it, it takes you to the app itself, our uh, one click dropship app. Great, so on this one click dropship app, you can see the entire dashboard. What you require to do on your first contact with this app is to come straight here on your profile, setting up your profile, and getting it connected to your uh, what we call again your AliExpress store. So here you have a basic information which you can set up. Then we'll get down to how to connect our Shopify store. Before you connect the Shopify store, it is expected you have a Shopify store running. Now look at the integration. This is your integration of anti AliExpress login credentials to use the automatic order fulfillment feature, which is what you have here. This is the automatic order fulfillment feature. So you have to enter it there for this feature to work properly for you so you can see and manage your orders here. Alright, so once you get your uh, store connected, you can always come down here to use the AliExpress Pi and Importer. So uh, the AliExpress Pi and Importer tool is that which allows you to search for any product you want which you want to take over to your Shopify store. So I'm going to show you how you can use this tool and your uh, Google that to set up a Shopify store so that it will make more sense to you and how all of this connect. So right here let's say you're looking for 
uh, like massages uh, okay, have massage kits here, and you can select what categories you want to work with. You can select if you want to search by keyword, or you want to search by your product SQ, you or you want to order by high to low or low to high. You also have the shipping method, whichever you want to identify here. So let's say we use the massage kits, and we'll hit on search here. All right, so uh, search is going on, it's processing. So we already have products coming up here. So on your product, you can scroll down here, and you can see the entire product you have here. You have the luxury, large range, short set, let's show head, and you can compare the prices and get to see the discount here. All of these are okay. We have high to low, so you can reorder this low to high because you don't want your product to appear to your ripping your buyer's pocket. But you want to give them products that are sizable. That will not break the bank for them. So we are hitting this while we've reordered this. Great. So we now have from low to high. So on low to high here, you can see I already have these imported. You can now scroll down to see other ones you can import. It's uh, 2017 hot. So men massage finger sleeve crystal set stimulate time delay product random color. So you can just hit on this and hit on import it. It's added, and uh, you can have a couple others which you can pick up here. Message, let's see. Okay, uh, let's also pick this. I hit on import, or you can also select this. Now, once you have all of that added here, you come down to your catalog. On your product catalog, you're going to see that uh, all of these products you'll find it on your product import queue here. So on your product import queue, you can see all that we've selected. They are showing pending, trending. So once they are fully imported or fully added, you're going to see the status showing here as completed. The white that is showing pending, once the server crawls it, it's going to pick it up. And once it picks it up, you're going to find it as all products imported. So you're going to see them right here. So on your imported product here, you can now come over to use the next function here, which is view. On your view here, it allows you to now use the next function to which we call the built-in editor. So this is actually the built-in editor which you have, which allows you to edit whatever content you want to edit. So as you edit on this content here, you can see the price here. You can also see compare price at this. You can also charge tax on this product. So once you do that, it does charges connecting it with the Shopify store once you put it down there. Then you have the shipping details here, which is also brought in. And another thing, interesting thing is that within the images here, you can assign your art text to this image to also uh, optimize your images for search engine. So once you click on it, you can add your image art text here, which optimize your search engine visibility. All right, so you also have the option of uh, product organization, the product type, the vendor, as well as uh, setting up tags. You can also set variations for your product. It could be variation based on color. It could be variation based on sizes. You could set all of it down here. All right, so once you have all of that done, you now have to, uh, of course, uh, once you go back here on the product here, you get to see how you can add this into your store here so you have to select the Shopify store and once this is done you can now save it so once you save you do not get connected to your store or of course you don't have this connected set says that is not connected so at this point here I will now take you through the process of getting your store connected but before we go over there I'm also going to take you on a walkthrough on some of the tools you can play around with the EP product finder does the same thing as your Aliexpress 5 product finder here. So you can find the product here and uh, once you go down here, you get to see the automatic order fulfillment. You get to see all orders that have been placed from the store and you get to see if your customer has uh, fully paid and if your wholesaler has delivered the product. You also get to get your sales report out here you can generate reports, you can select the store and generate a report. Now you also have your uh, multi-site adder here. Your multi-site adder here, this allows you to add more than one Shopify store. You could have a couple of stores as you want it to be. Then you have your multi-site product adder here, 
So your multi site photo here. Once you have this up, you get to see your Amazon stores here, All right? So you get to see our uh, your Amazon Spy Deploy here. You also get to see your Walmart Spy Deploy. You get to see the eBay Spy Deploy. You get to see Best Buy Spy Deploy. You get to see your Gear Bear Spy Deploy as well as the Easter Spy Deploy, your Bonanza Spy Deploy, and your Rakuten Spy Deploy. So if you are on Amazon. You click on Amazon, this will require you to search for products within your Amazon. So let's see we are searching for these within Amazon. You can do the same. So on Amazon, you already got this product here. You have the customer's reviews which you can check directly on Amazon. You can also view the product on Amazon. Of course, uh, you also see that this is prime eligible, that is a seller is prime eligible. So you could choose to import this product as well and add it. So as much product as you want to, you can of course keep adding it. So that will function with your uh, multi-site product adder, which allows you to get several products from other stores. So the same thing applies with Walmart. I deploy here. So with Walmart, you just type your uh, keyword. Let's see, use the message keyword here. You search it. It also helps to compare. The products and know what products are available that you can get from um, Walmart. All right, so if we're going for this now, you can also go ahead and import that. So we have a collection of products from several stores. We have from AliExpress, we have from Amazon, we have from Walmart. The search could go on and on. So imagine what it is just one place. You're dodging products from our collection of all the nine stores all in one place. So that's how great. Uh, Dropshipping Selling Academy, a one click dropship app is allows you to automatically fresh products from this stores and the purple from which you are purchasing this product automatically become your wholesaler provider. So that's what it is. Right, so switching over to our, e our Shopify account. This is our Shopify account. We're assuming that we're getting started for the first time. And uh, let's just see how we can set up an account for this. Let's see. Uh, I'm starting on my account. Let's use this uh, name here. All right. Let's just put it up here and see. All right. So it says that you're following the free trial, so you can just put up whatever password you want to put. All right. So uh, the store name can the same as password. So let's say we have been dealing a massage here. So we say message right. All right, so we have that message right store. So we have create the store now. So we're creating a store together. So that will not give us our subdomain name. So we now have site type. We're creating your store now. So store is uh, going undergoing the creating process here right now. Our right, success the store is ready to go. So tell us a little about yourself. Are uh, you already Sally? Let's just see. Uh, just playing around and around here. And we have to select uh, what re current revenue, of course. Uh, and just getting started. That's what it is. Are you setting up a store for a client? Of course, you could say yes. I'm designing, developing a store for a client. Now, this again tells you that uh, once you get to the money section, you can actually do all of these I'm doing now. So I can of course say yes to this. So once we're on our money making approach, you can see that you can of course be setting this up for your clients as well. So I hit now next here. So next you require to put the name here. So I just have here. You could have whatever name you want to put here. So I could just have here. So and that goes on and on here. I can just have my business here, uh, massage right. I have it there, it's massage right here. So I hit on enter my store, right? I says please enter valid address. This is, okay, this is optional. So we don't have a website address here, so we leave it there and we hit enter my store now. So that takes me up to our store dashboard here. So hit it, and it's processing it. Right, so dashboard is getting prepared here. It's still loading up here. Right, so we can see here that our dashboard is fully up. 
and of course we are on a 14 days trial here you can see your trial just got started here and uh, this takes us to you can see how to add the product you can see the sales channels here you can see your online stores you can select what theme you want to set up here and you can see your blog posts you can see your pages and you can navigate if you have a domain you can connect it to your domain as well here all right so you can see our current theme which is what is applied to this account here you also have a collection of other free themes you can work with you have your Shopify theme store here and you can upload on the team here of course you if you don't have an knowledge of using Shopify you can get to leverage and all the detailed Shopify uh, walkthrough guide here but for the purpose of this webinar I'm uh, just going to show you how to get this store connected and post your product to the store. So to do that, I'm going to my address bar on my address bar here. I'm now copying my URL. My URL is now becoming message right. That my uh, Shopify and that you can see here. Once we go back to our one-click dropship, I will hit back to my uh, Shopify. So in my Shopify, I'm required to just drop that URL, which is a URL there. You can take it out. You can also see it again. I drop it and I will hit on connect. All right, so it's processing that coming up. Great, so it has hit directly. It says uh, this app isn't listed on the app store, so uh, one click drop shop chip doesn't appear in shop price. So make sure you trust this developer. Of course, you do trust the developer. If you are about to install the one click drop ship, of course. Here yeah, you, you trust it and you want to go ahead and ensure all details manage products of course you are giving access to that you can view details you can also view the Shopify account data you can now set that up and say install on listed app you hit on install that once you do that you have it your Shopify store is connected all right, so you get to see this message. If you have an error trying to do that, you refresh it or you start it all over again, then you should be able to have a successful uh, connection between your Shopify as well as your uh, one-click dropship app here. So of course we have it as connected right now. So once you have that connected, all you need to come back is to go to your product uh, catalog here. You can see here we have all uh, products imported as well so we'll click on all products imported here all right so on all products imported here you can now see right here we have our imported products you could also have add new products manually and if you had clicked on view here going back to your product editor view you can now see uh, store which you want to select you can now select this store and uh, once you hit on save here of course it will show status all right so we have it published now you've saved that and you have the option to publish on shopify so you can hit on publish in shopify so once that is done it publishes directly to your shopify store so it's doing that all right, great. So you now have what status connected. You have what new products sent down to Shopify. So it's the Ad Light Travel Mid Massage Support System Package. Test down sex stop. Uh, all right. Let me recover equipment successfully published to our Shopify store. All right. So you already have it down there. Uh, you have the price here and compared price eight eight nine here. You have your inventory number stated here. So I can of course go back and uh, get some more products added down here so i go down to my product catalog and then get some two more products added so at this point here i'm looking down to get other products on it here uh, let's go down okay uh, i think uh, let's get this up on here i hit on view again so on my view here uh, you can now come straight down here I want to adjust my price. Uh, this I want to be selling at five or seven dollars. I want to sell it at seven dollars. I have it down there. You need to just compare price at uh, fourteen. Let it appear too. So we have a fifty percent discount on it already. So I have it there. I, all I need to come down 
window here. We should select the store here and I have it saved. Or of course, we have an ecom store. We pick it from is AliExpress. Uh, if it's saved. Once you have it saved there, uh, you can also come straight here and say publish. I want to publish to Shop Shopify. So the same thing applies here. We have that uh, successfully published. It's now showing connected. We'll publish it. So, so as much product as you have, you can do all of this. You can edit in line and you guys will see how it looks like. So now let's get over to our Shopify store and uh, refresh it and see a number of products we have on our store now. Uh, how it has gotten exported or yeah rather exported into a store right here let's also see what the public sees at the front so on your Shopify here you can go ahead to make some further adjustments like if you want to if you click on this now you can see some further adjustments you can make here of course uh, there are other marketing setup you can do here so you see here that all the uh, editing you did also applied here you can get to see your images brought in here. You can see your inventory, stock keeping unit, and shipping. There's a physical product. You see all the details specified here, and they see a search engine listing preview of this product. Uh, you can edit it to see how it looks like on your uh, search engine. So once you're done with that, you could add your tags. You could add a tag for editing it. You also apply there. So you see this is already on a line. You can also come down here to manage the store we are showing. It's shown on your line store here. And once you go over to your front end page, we've not designed to choose our team which we want to work with. You can see one of the product which we got in. If you want to see more of this product, what the public would see, you can come down to catalog here. So on catalog here, of course, you can see the two products we've sent down. This is our product one. This is a product to see the pricing which we talked we edited it to be compared from 14 to 7. So once you click on this, you can see the total detail of the products which the user is seeing or where the public user is seeing and you can choose to add this to cart. Once you've already set your payment uh, information on your uh, uh, Shopify account, you can now use all of these and come down to checkout. If you set up your PayPal account, the user can choose to pay using PayPal. I selected this product earlier and that's why we have it there. So uh, checkout isn't uh, available right now. That's because I've not set up my uh, checkout configuration using my uh, Shopify. So all of these I need to get right. The important thing is you've gotten to see how we can use our one-click drop shipping app here to get it connected or to export our products. We've gotten from uh, the our uh, overnight connected uh, stores into our Shopify account that allows you to now have a public storefront where you can use to step marketing to make your money right so now the point is all of these you can start setting up for yourself you could go straight ahead to set up a, a Shopify account for yourself get it connected with your one click dropship account and start promoting it straight on the go if you get down to the uh, our Facebook ad campaign you get to see how you can set up tripwire how you can make one sell combining several products and making more sales per yourself and that's the benefit you get using your one click dropship app All right so so far we've gone through our product walkthrough which is uh, what we've seen here right All right so we've seen how to set up our one click drop shipping app with our shopify next we'll be looking at how to make money from our drop ship in academy uh, of course in all the setup we've seen here are uh, seeing that one aspect with which you can make money is a crazy money making from running your own dropshipping business. I don't see anything that is as crazy as that. You make your money right on the go. You can uh, recall how we were able to edit the pricing of one product to another, a product which was uh, gotten for as low as 44%. Uh, I had to mark it up to $7 because it's a solution driven product everybody does nobody wants to get sick rather but everybody wants to get our uh, well everybody wants to look sound everybody wants to remain healthy so whatever product that helps solve a problem or that helps protect them from falling ill they are ready to spend your dollars on it and that's the uh, the catch you use in setting up your product so something going for a 0 0.44 cent I'm giving it up for seven dollars. That's a crazy markup I'm making up there. Of course, that is not uh, to say that we are ripping our buyers' our, our pocket. But rather, it's a close margin that really drives it 
want to want to pay for it because it's a quite a tangible product that's quite practical. So that's the crazy uh, kind of money you can make from shipping. Now, the other aspect of a money making angle we're looking at is helping others to set up agency. Now, all of these we've done and the entire process getting your uh, your account set up, which is your one click dropship app set up, getting my account. All of this process on a daily basis helping others to set up. And these are the tools you're going to use from your uh, one click dropship deck. So let's say I was to set up for a client. Now, what you should be interested in uh, your motor store adder here. So, on your motor store adder here, now notice here that I've got my first store connected. So as much clients that you get, you can come up here, connect the Shopify store, connect the Shopify store. All you'll be doing is down here, it's into it. You can be generating sales reports for them. Like if you want to look at automatic order fulfillment here, you can now come down here and click on it. So you can now select stores. As much stores as you have added here, you can select on whichever store. You have uh, other status open that which is closed. You can now search for it and see all the orders that have gone through through your stores, and you can make the report available to your client. All right. So we have uh, let's say any here. You can search. So that you can do from here. You can also get to see. Uh, uh, you mentioned how to add a multi store out of here. Add a multi store which you can do to your uh, client. Now, to really tell you, now if you can select your stores using this, you can generate whatever report. If there are cells in there, you can get to see right here. We don't have any cells. We have uh, zero profit, no cells yet. So that's what you can do in all of this. You can be sending a report to your clients, which you are managing. Now, you may be wondering, is there really a market for this? Of course, there is a huge market for it. Let's use one of the giant freelancers uh, portal here to check what we did here using the keyword setup dropship here. The page is coming out. All right, great. So on setup dropship here, the key phrase we use is setup Shopify dropshipping here. So on setup Shopify shop dropshipping here, you can see this guy is offering his for about $35. And he says, I will set up beautiful Shopify store, Shopify website. Let's go back. And he says, I will develop a pro automated Shopify dropshipping store. And this is going for one or fifty dollars of auction price, and it's over eighty-five uh, sales he has gotten. And this is going for thirty-five. I will set up a customized Shopify store that has gone for two hundred fifty-five reviews he has already gotten. So let's review this just the straight stores, and you can go right down in to get over one thousand results of this. One thousand results of this all within the same Shopify how much uh, the, 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 the advantage you have in helping millions of people out there who just want to own a store online and how much they've been making from this. And of course, you already have a tool that allows you to work more on product researches and importing or exporting this product into their various stores just from one platform. You have your several client stores connected and you'll be managing all of them just from one place. Right, so let's see. On this guy's uh, page here, you see that he has uh, quite uh, true offers here. He has his basic, he has a standard, he has his premium. Now, see what they are offering and see if you cannot do the same. Now, it says uh, Silverbird, build a beautiful Shopify store on a free theme with 10 to 20 products. Can you get that? They say on a free theme, and that's what they're giving for $35. Now, I'm going that, that's just what we've done. And if you go in depth into the guide on setting up Shopify store and other advanced tutorial on that advanced guide, you're going to see how you can. Of course, customize the Shopify account to become what you want it to be. Now you can see just 10 to 20 products, and with your one-click dropship account, now tell me how many products can you get? I can tell you an unlimited products you can get, and you are offering just 10 to 20 products you can get. And you didn't mention to your client that you can get this product available across your or over nine stores with your over 1,000 wholesale providers. You can get them connected down here. Now you see, set up payment gateway, connect upload, responsive design, uh, design customization, plugins and extension. 
number of products 20, number of pages 2, revisions 2. In three days, this can be done. All of these we've done in less than an hour. We've gotten all of this done. So if you give yourself a lot of time to really hone your skills in getting all of this done, you can imagine how much you'll be making. Now, this is going for just $35. And the person now sets this person up into a photo funnel of $65, which is a good offer on the standard. Best for small businesses, just 20 to 30 products. Uh, that is what is added here. And for the premium, which is the platinum, what's done here is the beautiful Shopify Storm premium team with advanced conversion boosting features. So you notice here that on our standard and basic, which is going for $35 and $65 respectively, this guy is leveraging on free theme, which is the same thing you can do as well too. Now, going down to what this other guy is doing here, uh, okay, this lady here has is going for $150, and you see she has already about uh, 4, 456 reviews here, which gives you how much she has already made setting all of this up. And her minimum is $150 here. It says ready to sell store with responsive design, 15 products, 3 apps, and policy pages. So just quite simple setup here. She has done everything, and she's ready to give it out. Just 15 products. And with the one-click app, you have tons of products you can use to populate on your uh, Shopify store, and you can be managing it from there, sending reports to them. None of these guys mentioned about sending reports, so you could propose automating their stores and sending reports, telling them how much sales they've done, because of course they don't need to uh, 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 get their hands done on anything. It's the wholesaler that does the shipping down to the buyers. So that's how crazy all of this is now. Coming down to this here, the guy is doing the same thing here, setting up Shopify store, and this is also going for $35. Uh, this guy too has got some good reviews, over 592 persons has reviewed his offers, meaning that his offers has really raked him some good uh, millions uh, just setting up. So these are things you could also be doing, dude. Once you set up these with your one clip app, you can get all of this done to your advantage and have your money raking in into your bank and um, right crazy here to press some buttons using our calculator and you get to see the number of figures you can be making just setting this up using your one click app and connecting it to your Shopify. here i have my calculator call up let's say you are also billing 35 dollars and let's say from your first sales or from the first ad you just got 50 requests and on 50 requests you're already making 1750 dollars just to set them up on the basic isn't this a huge sum of money and the target of 50 is something you can do all you need to do is stick to the academy the ads placement uh, that as well as branding of course in the academy pay attention to brand and branding shows you how you can of course set up yourself as an agency getting your logo design getting a website and getting an email address that connects to your business so that the public will see that you're serious with your brand and that's all you stand to get with your one click dropship academy i'm super super excited to have you sit all the way to listen to this discussion i've heard with you on a one click dropship app as well as a dropship selling academy i want to believe that you will make the most out of this course as well as this app and of course not just setting up for yourself but consider greatly becoming a service provider that is where the money lies, becoming a service provider. Yes, that is it. You can ping me. You can ask me. I'll always be glad to give you my uh, first class support through my team uh, members. And they will be happy to offer whatever assistance you need. One more, I'm happy to have you on board. I'm so, so happy. And we remain one family in here. I remain myself, victory, apart. Thanks.